Hey everyone, Dean Willette with Dean Sells AZ. On the way to meet a short sale client of mine, uh, we're getting an offer today, putting it under contract to begin our negotiations. And something that's important to address when you are getting to this point is can the bank come after you for the difference between what you're selling the house for and they approve the short sale for and what you owe on it? Well, the, there's many variables to that. If you live in Arizona, we have what's called an anti-deficiency law, which means that if the bank approves a short sale and you owe a higher amount, they cannot come after you for the difference. But what they are doing is they're working in language into the final approval now that says that we reserve the right to come after you for the difference. And if they reserve the right, then yes, and you sign that, then yes, they do have the right to come after you. Will they? not sure but it's not really a risk that I would be willing to take I'd want to know for sure so make sure you read every word of that final approval and make sure you understand it if there are any questions at all get legal advice talk to your realtor and make sure that you understand it and there are no questions uh, if you have any other questions on this or any other topics you'd like to see me address for, on short sales you know, leave a comment below or you can always email me dean at deansellsaz.com and have a great day